What's up, y'all? We back with another one, another one, another one. Reaction video. Fall in love with me. I introduce her to the game and let her thug with me. She be like Bunny and Clyde. She even clutching me. I feel like it's do or die. She give her soul to me. She want to be close to me. Oh, she said she fuck with me the long way. She said she gonna run my back. I had a long day. She said, baby, I ain't gonna lead you down the wrong way. Okay. <coughs> Hand going up. Like I told y'all, um, I'm gonna keep doing these uh, daily public freakouts. Again, is the YouTube page. This is public freakout compilation number 106. So make sure y'all go over there and subscribe. Give them the love that they deserve. Uh, if you want to just see a bunch of compilation of freakout videos without no reaction to them, there you go. But it's better with the reaction. It's better with me talking. Okay, it's much better that way. And again, I didn't look at them first, okay? These are the ones that I do not look at. So what I see, what you see was what I see, and that's what we see it together for the first time. So, ooh, I need some Starbucks. I am sleepy as shit. So we're going to get into this one. Um, and let's see what kind of craziness we come up with. Here it goes. Black man. Oh, is he finna cut up? Put it in the oven for two seconds. aggressive though like first of all subway ain't got but two people working there okay and one of them standing at the back eating i ain't never been to a subway where it got good customer service that's just not what they known for i don't fuck with subway as much as i used to um i'm gonna have to get my other headphones i don't fuck with subway as much as i used to because subway used to be the cure for hangovers but baby any subway you going to that customer service is garbage it's garbage you know that. Y'all know Subway be having some garbage customer service. And they don't never have enough people in there. Just, just, you ain't got to be rude, bruh. Unless they be in that level of rude. Like, I don't know why people do that. I don't go, especially in food places where people are making my food and get an attitude or talk to them crazy. Them people at their job that they probably don't want to be at. Why are you bothering them? I'm not finna play with nobody making my food. Why you gotta be so aggressive though? Cause it look like that's a woman. Okay, she trying to make you want the sandwich in there two two more seconds. You won't pick which tomato you want, nigga. If you don't order this goddamn sandwich and get the fuck on, fuck is you in here cutting up for? No, you don't know. You honestly don't know. You had me sitting here with only two people here for forty fucking minutes. You not understand that? I know my background. You didn't do no customer service, didn't check on nobody, you're handling one f***ing order at a time. Well, it don't look like it's but one person. You need help, When right? have you ever, baby, this exactly. ain't salada. You ain't never been to a Subway and they making multiple people sandwiches at one time. You, okay, they, they gonna make your sandwich from beginning to end. Come back. Beginning to end. Come back. It, why you acting like you ain't never been to Subway before? Is it just me? Because I already know Subway when I get there. This ain't Salada where, or Chipotle where they pass your shit down. That ain't how this work. <laughs> that, that ain't how this works. She probably the only one in there. Everybody else done called in. It's not, oh, I don't like the way he treat her. See, that's why they think black men ain't got no damn sense. Call him. Slap this shit out you if you touch me. And your man. Can so I please ahead, have a six get my foot? Face. My name is Blue Hunnids. You can Google me. You can Spotify me. Instagram. Me? <laughs> did that nigga did that, did that nigga say my name is Blue Hunnids? Blue Hunnids? Nigga, you look 
like a blue hunt. You look like a busted blue hunt. You know what? Just because of that, let me see. He said Google them, right? Okay, so let's Google them. Blue hunnids. Like, how, is it like hunnids? <laughs> I wonder if the blue got an E on it. Let's see. Hold on. Blue hunnids. No, that's a song. That ain't no person. Blue hunnids. Okay, so check it, right? It say blue hunnids subway. I don't know if y'all can see. Blue Hunted Subway. I don't know what I pressed. Blue Hunted Rapper Subway. Sir, you, you're known for your Subway act. Because you cut up in Subway. Let's see. Hmm. California Rapper Threatens to Beat a Female Subway Customer Before Blah, 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 Blah. Treats Women With Disrespect. Hey, oh, so he, a Cal oh, he from Cali. Not blue hunnids. Boy, if you don't take your old no name rapping fucking need your dreads redone looking ass on some fucking where come over here with that bullshit and watch your ass get popped with a few hunnids bullets, goddammit. Grab me. I would slap blue the shit out this lady if she touches me again. Point blank period. Well, if she touch you, I mean, and that's exactly how it's gonna go. Okay. Tell her keep her keep my name. Excuse me, Sam. Trying to, to order my sandwich. Okay. Okay. Please? okay. We have a problem now. Excuse me. So is the I'm problem trying done? To miss it. What is you want to act like a man, right? I'm here. What's up? <laughs> you step up to me like a Please, man, sir. You I'm trying to like order my sandwich. Finish. I'm speaking okay, to you. Okay. Can you please move? Cause oh, yeah. I. But I'm confused because, like. When it switched, he walked up to her. So when did she walk up to him? Like, I don't understand. Why is he being so aggressive? Like, did she, I didn't see her hit him like she could have, but I don't, I feel like this is a whole bunch of unnecessary shit. This is very extra because you are already being aggressive with the, with the subway worker. Now you fucking with the customer. Sir, go sit your, your blue ass down the fuck somewhere and keep quit fucking with these women. Please stop. Please stop. Come on now. Unless I miss something. I'm trying to, to talk to her. Please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're more than welcome. You done? Can I please have... Uh... Are you done? No. Do you okay, see my ahead. sandwich ready? I'm going to make comfortable. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm going to okay. see why, though, Go ahead. But why? Seriously? Like, you sit here talking about are you done, but a nigga, are you done? Like, are you done? See... This is where, and I probably won't even finish the rest of the damn video, because I'm already stuck on this part. This is where a situation is, this is a prime example of what we talk about when women hit men, men hit women, the whole self-defense, if you hit somebody, hit them back, blah, blah, blah. I know, me knowing in this situation, right, I know me as a person. What do I always tell y'all? I hit first because I do not like being threatened or people close to me like that because I don't know what people are capable of. So I got anxiety. I'm bipolar. I don't know. You being this close to me is triggering me. Therefore, if you don't back the fuck up, I am going to hit you. As a woman, I'm going to hit you first because you're being aggressive. And me knowing that I'm a woman, you're a man, you're bigger than me, you're ge genetically built bigger than me, you're stronger than me, so there is a chance that you're going to whoop my ass, but I don't give a damn, it's going to be a hard motherfucking fight, because the one thing I do know about myself is my strength, my level of fighting skills, and how fucking crazy I can be. So you ain't finna just knock me out and be done. You not finna do that. You, you in my face, bruh. Talking about, are you done? Nigga, are you done? Can you please move? Because ain't no way, cuz no, you not finna do that to no sister. And if you are, he's giving very much like domestic violence vibes. He's giving me very much I abuse women on a regular vibes. He's giving me very much I disrespect women on a regular vibes. Period. He's way too aggressive. Niggas that are that aggressive have no respect for women. I don't care what anybody says. He's giving off way too fucking aggressive. You're doing the absolute most right now. Nobody knows who you are. You're not a big rapper, okay? I don't know rappers like that. Do y'all know who he is? If y'all know who he is, drop it in the comments. But you're doing too much. You're doing way too much, sir. Bake, bake the fuck up. 
up off me like that. I don't even like people in my personal space. She. Um, Seriously, can I what? have uh, yeah, Jack? Exactly. exactly. You thought it's all fun and games, right? Okay. It's all fun and games. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck she Please. needs. Shut your little bitch ass up. You can smack Go ahead. Really? This is public. Keep recording. And I'm going to keep standing here because it's public. Yeah, but you prove need to stand six feet. Prove your feet. point. You I'm going to prove my point. six feet prove apart. It's COVID. What no. is the That's point? That's a policy, you idiot. Do you not know what a policy is? Law Me? is law. Sir. Policy is what? what? You're spitting you're in idiot. my eyes. Ain't nobody spitting on you. Yes, you're speaking out. Hold on, y'all, because I might not be able to finish the rest of this because y'all know I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I got a problem because why are you fucking with me in such a capacity? You're not book smart or street smart. I hate a fake gangster nigga. I really do. Let me tell y'all something. Put y'all up on game real quick. <clears throat> Fuck the video. I'm going to put y'all up on game real quick. A real gangster nigga, like a real, real gangster nigga, you ain't gonna know he a gangster nigga. That's the that's that's the problem. A real true OG ass don't play no motherfucking games, nigga. I swear you ain't gonna know he a gangster because real gangsters don't do all that motherfucking talking. The real OGs is the ones walking around in the motherfucking suits, bitch. I grew up in the hood. I promise you, I know gangsters. To this day, I, it's a motherfucking game. My life is filled with them. A true gangster ain't gonna do that. All that fucking talking and shit like a bitch, that ain't what gangsters do. That ain't what thugs do. Real thugs, real Gs move in silence. Like lasagna. <laughs> okay, did y'all miss that boy? Real OGs do not move like this, son. So this whole I'm book straight, I'm smart, I'm street smart, and I'm ball. No, nigga, you just crazy. <laughs> like you really just crazy. You ain't no real OG, cuz. <laughs> like you know, no disrespect, I ain't in no gang or no shit. But you ain't no real OG because real OGs, you ain't gonna even know they OGs until they gotta be OGs. You ain't gonna know a gangster is a real gangster until he gotta be a gangster. Cause they don't walk around ripping, oh nigga, I'm I fuck you up, nigga. Da, 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 da. Maybe you gonna sit your bitch ass down somewhere. Show ass fucking with these goddamn women. Talking about I slap the shit out of you. Why you ain't go fuck with a nigga like that? Go up to OG and tell him you gonna slap the shit out of him. Let me see that. And then you being even more stupid because if you are a rapper or trying to be a rapper, then you would know what's called P fucking R, public relations, nigga. You making yourself look bad already and your career ain't even started. Like you still making beats in your mama's basement. Quit fucking playing with me. Quit fucking playing with me. And that abandoned ass building studio you got. No, sir. No, sir. Quit. Bro, sit the fuck down. Sit. I, they done pissed me. I done got mad. God damn it. I can't even finish my fucking video. How ass nigga? You, you want to see a gangster? I got a couple of them I can show you. Hmm? I got a couple of gangsters I can show you. And that's on mamas. I tell people not to fuck with me for a reason. <laughs> She has on Adidas sneakers. You tell me uh, those are tennis shoes. No, no. Yeah. you talk right here. I don't want to talk outside. This is something you probably would sell. 
This is something you probably missed. It's the it's the house. She has on Adidas. She has on Adidas. Dress up. Adidas and Nike. This is what happened with that. I don't know if y'all remember that. Uh, remember that that video from the black chick who had the little boy. And he had on like some uh, Jordans and shit. He was fly to motherfucker too. And they wouldn't let them eat. But the little white boy outside had on the same fucking outfit. But except he got his shit from like Walmart or some shit. Like I don't know. It didn't match. Whatever. That's what they do. That's what this. That seemed like what this is. We'll just wait until the cops come in here. We'll just wait. But the other lady. Please, please. So no. Right right. So, no. no. This her father shit. He actually handled it way better than I would have. Don't say so. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. He got say one some. name? Say some bitch. See, you don't fuck with it. Let me tell y'all something. I'm finna look, look, look. I ain't seen this shit. See? See? You got a nigga fucked up. You got a nigga fucked up. I'm telling you, you don't think I can, dog. I'm gonna shove this up your ass, dog. You know what? Give me this shit, mother. Let's go. Hold up. with one motherfucking leg because nine times out of ten a lot of the times believe it or not a lot of the times them be army niggas like them be veterans that done lost their leg or a limb or something and they some aggressive motherfuckers i don't fuck with niggas in wheelchairs with leg especially that nigga see that's why i don't fuck with homeless people i don't fuck with nobody that's struggling because they ain't got shit to lose they ain't got shit to lose they not in their right mind they don't they not uh nourished they fucking Thirsty than a bitch, hungry than a bitch, broke than a bitch, mad at life. I'm not fucking with that nigga. Did y'all not see how he grabbed an umbrella? He took that bitch off the table. See, I already knew. I said it before he even did it. He was finna get into some gangster shit. I'm good, homie. What? You need five dollars? Mm, you want to get something to eat? Uh, you want you want some food, some water, or something? You, no, you good? Okay. No, I love Karens. Karens are I so amazing. Karen. You are, you are beautiful, Karen. Mm. Of the oh, Karen. Mm. You are beautiful. Of the backyard. Oh, Karen. Oh. Mm. Y'all gonna get enough of hitting people with them guys. Karen, phones. Karen. Y'all gonna get enough of hitting people phones. Y'all gonna quit that shit. You're gonna work on my teeth, not my nose. Oh, okay. I don't so we're gonna stop it right here. I already reacted to this in a previous video. If you wanna see that reaction, then you gotta go back. So. Therefore, and that was the last one. Um, yeah, I reacted to that one a long ass time ago. So if y'all y'all know what, just pull up the reactions playlist and just play that shit. Y'all know y'all fucking love reaction videos anyway. Um, so that was another one. I'm gonna see if I can get some more done today, but y'all know my neighbors be neighboring and shit, and so I don't they don't respect my artistry. It's gonna be five of motherfucking clock before I know it, and they're gonna be coming home. So maybe I can get some done tonight. But 
I will get these edited up and scheduled. Ooh, but I really want to do the other ones I got. We're going to see when I get back from Starbucks because I definitely got to go to Starbucks. But on my way to Starbucks, y'all going to see me in the same motherfucking outfit, bitch, because we finna do a motherfucking trafficking check because I got some shit to say. See you in that one. Bye.